there, folks. So you're having a squirrel problem. Well, so am I. Let's see if we can figure out this problem together. There's lots of options out there. You go to a department store, you go to Lowe's, Home Depot, and they got squirrel repellents, they got strobe lights, they got sound generators that apparently only squirrels can hear. In my experience, none of that stuff works. Squirrels laugh at those kinds of techniques. The only th two things, in my opinion, that can possibly work are either a kill trap or a regular trap so you can deport the buggers. Now, I'm gonna use a regular trap uh, from Have a Heart. It's about $30, you can find it anywhere, Lowe's, Amazon, Home Depot. And once you catch the squirrel, you're gonna need to deport them. Uh, squirrels apparently can find their way home from within a six mile radius. So you gotta drive them away from your house further than six miles. So it's not gonna be enough to just trap them, walk over two blocks, and dump them in your neighbor's yard. Ain't gonna work, they're gonna find their way back. They're so annoying, they leave a path of destruction where they go. They always turn these pots over, so they basically they run up these stairs, make it to this landing, and then from this landing they jump over to the other side of this gutter. There's a soffit there. They've chewed through and they're making a nest. Hey look, there he is right now, or she, whoever yelling at me. No good. They gotta go, folks. I'm sorry. As much as I hate the critters, I couldn't, I couldn't possibly kill them. So I'm gonna use the have a heart trap. Fairly simple. So it's got, it's got a door out here that opens up. There's a wire that falls all the way down here and you lock it in with this plate. The same wire is what keeps the door propped open. All right, I'm gonna open up the door. I'm gonna at the same time, my right hand, prop the door against the wire and I'm gonna lock the plate against the wire. And what's gonna happen is the squirrel's just gonna step on here and it should close the door. I'm gonna put some peanut butter in. All right, peanut butter right on the plate. I'm gonna add in some walnuts for good measure right in the peanut butter. All right, yummy. What a tantalizing snack. Squirrels can't possibly resist. All right, trap is set right here, because I know there's a lot of squirrel foot traffic that comes through here. Heck, maybe I'll even put a walnut right outside here. Leave some crumbs leading in, finally leading up to that. Well, I'll come back later, see what I got. It's the following morning and have ourselves a visitor. Hello visitor, where's your paperwork? I'm sorry, we're gonna need to deport you. You don't even pay rent. So, we're gonna need some gloves, probably a box. So I got myself a pair of gloves, because she's probably gonna try to throw those hands, potentially. Got a piece of cardboard too, because look at that mountain of shit she created. I don't want that in my car as I deport her. Let's get her to the car. I'm gonna drive out six miles and drop her off. All right, we're at the drop-off point, just about six miles away. Put some gloves on, some nuts for the road. Let's go on a little journey, little one. Wow. Wow. Now for Papa Bear, because he's still out there somewhere. All right, one down, one to go. Where's that useless boyfriend? He didn't even come to her rescue. Once again, peanut butter and walnuts. Kind of like a family guy. That's how I like to imagine it went down. <gasps> Ooh, piece of candy. Ooh, piece of candy. Ooh, piece of candy. Ooh, deported. And another one. And that's how you catch and get rid of squirrels. If you liked the video, please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.